what's up guys? It's Wire C3 Emmanuel Sanders with the Broncos. What's up you guys? Came towards MetLife Stadium. Get ready for the Jags. Football is back, baby. Football is back. You guys about to ride with me to the game. We got the Seahawks today, first game of the year. We need a win. Let's go. I got the Tudor out today. It's my baby right here. Love her to death. Let's go on this tour ride to the stadium. Let's do it. Headed to the stadium, Maha Stadium, week one. You know, we got the Seattle Seahawks and just driving to the stadium with just jitters. We got a team that's the locker room, the culture, um, it's just so positive. Um, a true brotherhood. Um, and, and we got a new quarterback that I know Bronco Nation is gonna be excited about, man. He's a good quarterback. So yeah, it's week one. Preseason's over with. No more waiting around, no more taking players off, no more resting. It's time to get it started. Time to get it heads cracking. Man, I put a smile on my face just thinking about it. You know, being a veteran wide receiver, this is my ninth year. You know, I feel like I still got four or five more years. I don't think there's a young guy out there that can outrun me right now, so. Just gotta go out and ball, go out and make plays, keep the crowd on their feet, man. I want, I want to be that energy guy. I want to be that guy when I make a play, or my teammates make a play, be excited. Um, like, you know, lift people up, uh, never bring them down. Always speak the truth. Um, just live by that code. So this shit for the Giants, we we looking very very good. We looking very well, healthy. Very prepared for this game, um, for this season, this upcoming season. The guys are very focused. Um, just to start all over with new guys, new faces. Not a lot of guys been on the team last year, so we don't have to harp on what happened last year. And returning faces, we can go back to a new slate and make sure it's just start all over. You know, most guys came from winning teams, and it makes a difference when you come from winning teams because you know how to win, you know what it takes to win, and you know the determination. Broncos fans are the best. The game's been sold out for I don't even know how many years. I think it's like 40 some years, maybe even longer than that. You know, all the games have been sold out. So today is going to be a packed crowd. I know they're excited. Um, you know, they can feel the energy around the city that we're going to be a pretty good team. And they're going to come out loud, excited. All right, so we're here, man. I appreciate you guys riding with me. See you after the game. This year in the NFC East, man, I'm very excited towards this year because not many guys, uh, not many teams know what we have up our sleeve or what they're uh, to expect. It's a whole new program, it's a whole new face, it's a whole new coaching staff, whole new defense, whole new offense. So I think it's going to be a good run for us. Leaving the stadium now, feels good, man. We got a W. Yeah, it, feel, it felt good to have a, a 130 yards, too, to start out the regular season. That's everything that I wanted, um, to start fast, uh, get ahead, have to have 10 catches, 135 yards, and an explosive play, and just keep making those plays. It just feels good. I, I, I work my butt off. You know, I've, I've dedicated myself the past six months, and it just feels good to see all the hard work pay off. And, you know, as, as, as much as I want to go and celebrate this one, I'm, I'm, I'm anxious to go and get in the cold tub and just keep working because I understand how the NFL season goes. There's a lot of highs and there's a lot of lows. And I, I just got to stay the course. I can't can't get over excited. I got I to gotta stay humble within myself and um, keep rehabbing, uh, keep taking care of my body, keep doing everything, the necessary things, so I can go out and make those plays over and over again for 16 weeks. And hopefully longer than that, hopefully we can make a Super Bowl run. So. Uh, that's my mindset. What's up, you guys? Landon Collins back here with my girlfriend, Victoria, after the game. Uh, we had a good close game. A little mental errors cost us the game. And as always, that's always that's always the case scenario. But um, we got next week. I'm looking forward to Dallas next week. But hope you're all right. I 
I just pulled up to my house. I'm about to go eat. Give me some rest. On to Oakland. So I'm looking forward to next week of, well, actually this week of keep getting better. And hopefully next week we can build on it and be 2-0 um, around this time next week as well. So thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate you guys coming along on my game day commute. See you next time.